It's a uh, Sunday morning, guys, and Tegan and I have tattoos. We just did this. Tegan has a, a Dory tattoo, and he picked out this Marlin, whoa, this Marlin tattoo for me. So we have matching tattoos. He doesn't quite know what it is yet. <laughs> you eating your breakfast? Uh, is that yummy, yummy oats? <laughs> He's goofing off because I have the camera on him now. <laughs> we reviewed Flurry Heart yesterday and we brought it out here to take a couple Instagrams of it. And Tegan has really enjoyed playing with her. Of course, he's not going to now because I turned the camera on. Tegan, who's next to you? Who's this? Nope, not even gonna pay attention to her now, but he, before he was feeding her the bottle and showing her the ball. I know. Like petting her on the head. He's not gonna interact with her at all because I turned the camera on. Go figure. Okay, you guys may remember we bought these Winnie the Pooh storage boxes at the yard sale yesterday, and we were a little confused who this kid on the box with Pooh and Tigger was, but you guys let us know it was from a Disney Junior show called My Friends Tigger and Pooh. We'd never even seen it. And today, coincidentally, I'm just going to the Disney Junior app on the Roku. And look, for the first time ever, I've never seen this show available. Not only that, like almost every single episode you can watch for free right now. So I think we're going to give it a try. What do you think, guys? Yeah. Why not? Isn't that crazy? We just bought those at the yard sale. Yeah. Never even heard of the show before. It's nuts. And there it is. It's from 2009, you said? Yep. So let's give it a go. Let's see what it's all about. Look how bare our house is getting. Ben is on a packing frenzy right now. I think it's stressing out Tegan and the cats because they think Ben's just going to move out. Jenna and Ryan are going to be here soon to babysit Tegan because Ben and I are having a date night movie night. We're finally going to see... Finding Dory! Hi. There's Ben. She's going to make an appearance today. Hello. So they should be here any minute, but in the moon, moon time. <laughs> yeah, they're supposed to be here 15 minutes ago, I think. <laughs> so in the meantime, let's watch some Pooh Bear. All right. Who's here? Who's here? <laughs> what movie are we gonna go see? Finding Dory. Nice, I've been wanting to see that. I'm not gonna babysit. I'm going with you guys. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, yeah, just babysitting by yourself. How yep. does that even work? <laughs> We're here at the movie theater, and guess what movie we're gonna see? Suicide Squad, Pete's Dragon, <laughs> Star Trek. No, we're gonna see Finding Dory. Yay! Not a lot of people out and about today. This parking lot is pretty empty. Yeah, it is. Even the theater was pretty empty. Mm-hmm. Well, it's a beautiful Sunday. Yeah, beautiful Sunday and on a holiday weekend. Pure Tegan's having fun with Jenna and Ryan. I can't wait to hear what they've been up to. Mm-hmm. Hopefully he's staying out of trouble. Ryan, that is. <laughs> <laughs> so on our way home from Finding Dory, Ben. Yes. Spoiler free review, how many stars would you give it? I'd give it five stars. Maybe four stars. How many Nemos on a scale of one to five Nemos? Probably four Nemos out of five. Four Nemos? I think the original Finding Nemo gets five Nemos. This one <laughs> didn't quite live up to Finding Nemo expectations, but it was but still, it was really, still good. really good. Yeah, I can't wait to see it again on Blu-ray, and I'm sure Tegan will love it. I think so. So, big thumbs up, mm -hmm. and you, spoiler free, we're not going to spoil, spoil anything, but stay tuned to the very end of the credits, because as the credits are rolling, you'll see a few names in the list of cast members who didn't appear in the actual movie, mm -hmm. but kind of appear at the little thing at the end. Right, so you definitely want to stay till after the credits if you haven't seen the movie already. You've been turned to me. It's like, was were these so and so and so and so? Did I miss that part? I... <laughs> I was reading the cast <laughs> list, and I was like, 
did I blank out and miss something? And he goes, no. <laughs> so if it. you've already seen Finding Dory, when you get it on DVD, fast forward through all the credits, mm -hmm. and there's a little bit at the very, very end. It doesn't set anything up for any future movie or anything. No, no it's just cute. Yeah, just a cute little joke at the very, very end. I really liked the short at the beginning. With the little with the little bird who kept yes. trying to run into the water to get uh, food. Yeah, I thought that was adorable. Usually usually Ben sort of, you know, is like eh towards the shorts. The yeah, beginning. I don't usually like the shorts. <laughs> so I really like that one. I thought it was very, very cute and the animation was amazing. What they're able to do is just crazy. So out of all the new characters in Finding Dory, yeah. who was your favorite? Was it Hank the Octopus? I think it was um, the Beluga. The I forgot, Beluga. I forgot his name. Bailey. Already. Bailey, no, Bailey the, was the whale. Sh no. No, no. Destiny. Destiny was, was the whale shark. Bailey the Beluga. Yes. See. Bailey. I have the memory of Dory. <laughs> <laughs> so what did you what did you think of old Hank? I liked Hank. Pretty much the kind of character you would expect. The character. <laughs> so, but he, I liked him. <laughs> 